What led to the shooting of a 20 year old man in a South Fargo neighborhood late last night? Meanwhile, neighbors are still on edge, telling us authorities are no strangers to their area. Valley News Team's Courtney Lockie has the latest. Since the start of the year, police have responded to several serious calls in the East Gateway Circle South area off of 25th Street South, including assault theft and breaking and entering. A lot of things that are happening here, they've always been happening. It seems like there's cops always coming through and uh, ambulances and fire trucks. Add Thursday night's shooting to the list of events that have neighbors so uneasy. All of a sudden we heard a pop, pop, pop. Gunshots rang out a little after 9 p.m. Police blocked off the entire street, searching with flashlights and taking photos of evidence. The entry door was shattered and police found several bullets. People arguing and um, kind of yelling. It just seemed like something kind of bad had happened. A 20 year old victim was found hours later with injuries from the shooting. The man showed up to the Moorhead Walgreens with blood on him and his friends called the authorities. It seems <laughs> like a lot of our tragedies, like they go misheard. It's very scary. Too close to my new home. Neighbors still want answers and they're hoping police continue to weed out trouble. In Fargo, Courtney Lockie, Valley News Live. If you have any information about last night's shooting, police are asking you to call or text their anonymous tip line. And we have links on our website. Download the VNL News app.